The Marines are here at the commissioning ceremony in order to basically represent our bonds that we've had for several, several years throughout the Marine Corps and the Navy traditions. Just kind of symbolizes how we do business. We support them and they support us and just one of those traditions that we've carried on forever. About the ceremony today was just a conglomeration of the police, the fire department, the Navy, the Army, all the different services and the people of Philadelphia and the families and friends that came together. It was literally like America was holding hands today. Just a great tribute, great honor to get everybody together and, and see how much support the military really does have. Feels great to honor the passengers of that flight. Feels great to honor the Navy. Feels great to honor America. Today, Philadelphia has come together as one, not just the city, but all the flight passengers and every, uh, the family members have all came together and, and just been a great tribute to the, the flight that went down. The biggest thing for me, and it's, it's very important, that they understand that we do live in a volatile world and we must continue to prepare to defend our nation, our way of life. Uh, the moment we leave sight of that, then uh, something far worse than 9-11 could harm our people. One of the greatest things about the ceremony for me was the, uh, the deserving recognition the American people gave it. Plus, uh, it's fantastic to happen right here in Philadelphia, a, a place so rich with the spirit of liberty. You know, just about a week ago, we celebrated the flag raising on Iwo Jima, where it was said of the Marines that uncommon valor was a common virtue. I can tell you, the Marines we have with us, uh, that holds oh, true yes, today. Please be seated. I mean, the ship's mission, after all, is to transport the United States Marine Corps' uh, mobility triad, the air, land, and ground uh, amphibious insert insertion. The Marines of 2nd Marine Logistics Group are going to take away a lot today. As the Commandant was speaking, there wasn't a dry eye in the, in the stands. We all thought about what happened that day, and it really snapped us all back to that point in time and place in history where we were that day. Make no mistake. This vessel, along with the other San Antonio class amphibious ships, represent America's commitment to security throughout the world. Somerset and the Marines and sailors she will carry will add mildly to the quiver of American diplomacy. Well, it's very humbling, and it, it truly is an honor to, uh, to pay tribute to uh, average everyday Americans who found themselves in an extraordinary situation and uh, selfishly gave up themselves for the greater good. Uh, you know, I said it many times, I honestly believe it. Uh, these individuals are truly heroes, and we absolutely cannot forget them.